Good morning everyone. So I thought I would do a what I eat in a day. I, I see these around all the time. I love watching them. And I actually have done one before, quite a long time ago though. I'll link it below if you want to see that one, but it was ages ago. It was probably about six to eight months ago. So I thought I would do one today. Um, I've actually just done a workout, probably about, I finished it about 20, 25 minutes ago. I do need to get in the shower, but I've been getting, I've been going to bed earlier. We basically, our routine as of lately, getting the kids to bed, um, Graham's been like sorting out animals and stuff, putting them to bed, and then we've been watching one Walking Dead. I think we watched two last night actually, because we were we had enough time. But we've been going to bed so much more reasonable, and I've been waking up earlier, and I've just been feeling a lot more motivated to do it that way. Um, so I did a T25 um, cardio this morning. Um, Alistair's been up since six. I did that at half past six. Um, yeah, and I'll show you what we're going to have for breakfast. Me and Alistair pretty much all week have had porridge. Um, and I've got some filter coffee on the go. Again, I've been having just, just black coffee, um, occasional with a bit of milk in, but I just, I love just filter coffee. Um, so yeah, I've just done my porridge. Uh, I'm probably just going to add a little bit more milk. I, I quite like mine, quite creamy and milky. Um, and I've just been using the skimmed milk. Me and Alistair will share that. Our favourite topping um, for the kids as well is chopped up dates. So I usually use four dates and me and Alice usually have two each. I've nearly run out. I usually get a big box from Costco. It's like filled to the top and it's about five pounds. Really, really reasonable. I've been snacking on pineapple and then Violet's going to have Cheerios when she wakes up. She, I, I guarantee she probably wants cereal. She's such a cereal girl. And then Alistair has one of these. Again, I got these from Costco and they were... 12 of them for £1.50. So me and Alistair have been getting through those because Violet doesn't like them. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much gonna be my breakfast. I'll show you once it's together. Okay, breakfast. So yeah, like I said, me and Alistair have porridge with dates and a little um, dusting of ground cinnamon. Love that, I need some more of that. Pineapple, got a black coffee, water. He's got water, he's got his little thing. He loves those. Um, and yeah, that is pretty much breakfast. And if they want extra fruit, go for it. We have loads. Okay, snack. I'm having a pink lady apple just sliced. And then I really wanted to try this cashew nut butter with honey and cinnamon. Yeah. It tastes really, really good. I mean, cashew nut butter is probably my favourite out of nut butters. Um, it just, it's just uber sweet and yummy. So I've got that and just water for my snack. Okay, so I'm going to show you my lunch and Violet's lunch. So she has got a ham pitta. She's got um, some hummus, some carrot sticks. She's got a little bit of this banana and caramel yogurt, which we've had both, got some of it. Um, and I've just topped it with sliced bananas and blueberries and she's got water. And then I made some homemade falafels. One, I've never made them before. And two, I've actually never tried them before. So um yeah, I'll leave the recipe link below. The one I used, it was just a pin, very simple. Um, and they turn out really, really well. They look very yellow, like very turmeric -y. Um, So I gave her like a mini one to try. She might like them. She loves chickpeas, she loves garlic, she loves that sort of thing. So I've got more if she wants more. But I've done myself one pitta, um, and then I filled it with spinach, three of the falafel balls. And then I've also got some carrot sticks and hummus on the side, also some yogurt, blueberries, and banana. And then we've got water as well. So that is pretty much our lunch for today. For dinner, I'm about to put on these burgers, but I thought I'd show you them before because Graham has been in the cutting room today making sausages and burgers. And he, well, this time of year, everyone goes crazy for our burgers. So um, yeah, he's gone and made us some super chunky, yummy looking original beef burgers. So we're gonna have some of those. Okay, so for dinner we have got um, bunless burgers. So um, I'm using just big iceberg lettuce leaves for our buns. So you can just do that with them. And then we've got new potatoes. I do that just so we don't have to have like too much like heavy carb because I probably wouldn't be able to eat the rest of it. Um, so yeah, we've got Graham's burgers that he made today, just our own beef burgers. I have some cheese on top, some red onion. We've got some uh, black olives, green olives. Um, sorry, excuse the kids. Tomatoes, half an avocado. Actually, no, I'm sharing a quarter of avocado and some new potatoes. Um, yeah, so that is mine. Actually, Graham's as well. He doesn't like tomatoes, but 
he's got a hefty bit of new potatoes and then that's the children's as well they pretty much have everything I have anyway okay for evening pick me up the kids are in bed Graham's got a regular tea we're going to share some of this I've got the sleep easy tea which is really nice actually um, it's basically chamomile cinnamon orange it's just really nice it's quite fragrant but nice um, yeah so that is pretty much evening snacks <laughs>